All right, everyone, it's time for some pocket planes, tips, and strategies. First up, we're going to look at choosing destinations where higher price is not always better. In this first example, we're in Santiago, and we're going to take a look at a flight paying $3.86 per cargo slot to demonstrate that higher price does not always equal better in terms of profit per minute. So we're paying about 900 coins or just over 3,000 coins per hour. However, if we back out of this, unload the cargo, and look at an alternate route to Lima, paying less per cargo slot, we can make 600 coins, which is less. However, we'll be making 3,600 coins per hour. So it doesn't take a rocket scientist to understand that maximizing your profit per hour for each of your planes is going to make you more money in the long term if you're playing this game frequently. The next tip is really a no-brainer. Get the 25% cargo bonus by filling your plane to capacity to single destinations. In this example, we will fly from Miami to Santiago without a full plane. Notice we're losing 33 coins. So if we fill the plane up, making the same flight, we're now making 1,600 coins for the exact same flight. So be patient, people. Fill the plane, get the cargo bonus. Looking at another example here from Santiago, we're going to load up a flight and see what our profit would be to Lima should all five slots be filled. We will make about 877 coins, which in eight minutes is really good. It's about 6,500 coins per hour. However, if we were impatient, say a few minutes ago, the jobs hadn't updated, if we just wanted to get a plane in the air, you would see a significantly lower profit of only about 319 coins. So be patient. It pays off in the end if you're a frequent player. So that concludes my first video of tips. Follow me on Twitter, hit me up on pocketplanes.wordpress.com, or follow my YouTube channel. There'll definitely be more tips in the series.